makeup, which is why I hadn't been wearing makeup lately, because I had been unhappy with the drugstore stuff I was using. So I'm wearing almost all unique makeup, except for the liquid liner is, I got it over here, it is L'Oreal, and the concealer is Maybelline, because I didn't buy any of that stuff. So, I have my friend Shaniqua here. Hello. Who you guys definitely know. You've seen her in vlogs. You've seen her in other videos that I've done. You've done my hair and makeup like You were way pregnant. Back when, yeah. yeah, when she was pregnant. And then I got pregnant and then I had a baby. Okay. So, I'm doing like a little haul of unique slash. I just bought something at Walmart that I'm really excited about. So, I want to show that too. So, we can show that part first. I uh, did this review a year ago at TJ Maxx where I bought that really cheap brush for my face. And honestly, I've been getting comments recently about it. So I was like, oh my gosh. So I found one that was $44 at Walmart and I wanted to try it. It's by Olay. It's just a basic one. There's nothing special about it to be honest with you. It's actually what it looks like it's actually not too much different I mean it's it doesn't feel like super expensive or anything like that but I really needed something because I kept trying to wash my face which is another reason why I hadn't been wearing makeup lately I kept trying to wash my face with my hands and yeah, it, it just wasn't like it was getting all gross and liquidy and like greasy and I was just still getting pimples all the time and I was like oh my god why am I washing my face so I just quit wearing makeup but I quit washing my face too, so I got um, I got something else that I left out there, so I'm not going to show you that, but this came with it. It's just a gentle exfoliator because it's something else I need. I have a very gentle cleanser from Neutrogena, so I need an exfoliator to kind of get rid of dead skin like once a week because you definitely need that, um, especially because my friend who sold me all the unique makeup said all your dry spots are really going to show through if you don't exfoliate your skin, so yeah, once a week. Yeah, and moisturize. Yes, so I have a big CeraVe moisturizer, which I really love, so I'm going to keep using that. So there's no, like, rhyme or reason how we're going to do this. She's going to pick a product and show you, and then I'll pick a product, and we'll kind of just go from there. <laughs> That's the washer. Jeez. Doesn't it get really loud? Yeah, it's like okay. vibrating. I'm doing floor. laundry right now. Okay, so we'll go with first. You can um, show it. Okay. It's what I'm wearing on my lips right now. It is called Splash. Yeah, I think that's the name of theirs. They're like liquid lipstick splashes or Mood whatever. Struck Splash Liquid Lipstick. Yep, and it's in the color. It's at the other side. Up here? Yeah. Sensual. Ooh. I wanted a really like deepish, and it's, I don't know how I feel about it yet. I used it once and it's kind of still been, like if I'll show you, look. And then some comes off. That's not a good yeah, sign. It's not very... But I used it once. The packaging is really nice. I just like how it looks. It's really heavy. It's not yeah. like, it doesn't feel like something I got from the dollar store like every other thing I buy. Yeah. But I don't know, I'm gonna play with it a little. I'll show you the next thing because I used it right before it. But I don't know if, I don't know if I applied it right, if I did it a little weird. It's the first time I ever applied it. It's a way different than a chapstick, lipstick, lip gloss. Yeah. It felt rough almost. I don't know if it's supposed to feel that way, but I also got this. I got a lip exfoliator. Um, from Unique because obviously I was about to put liquid lipstick. I didn't want chap lips. Mm -hmm. So it's just sugar, I'm pretty sure, I think, is what all it is. It's like sugar and... I don't have the ingredients because yeah. I don't have the box. Um, wait, let me see. Yeah, no, it doesn't say. So it's just like sugar and I think like water or something like that to make this type of consistency. It worked really good. It made my lips really soft. I actually really like that. I'm pretty excited for it. I think... I think I paid... I did a really big deal, like they were having, my friend was having a party, so I think I paid $12 for this. I can't remember everything, so I don't remember the price of everything. I'm just gonna do it all at the same time. That's fine. So it's all the same thing. Three pigments. Pigment, shimmer, matte. Come in shimmer and matte. Yeah, I don't, one, so I bought one, which, let me see the colors. This one, I bought the one I bought this shimmer. Here, I'll take it out and I'll show you. Does it have the names on the box or on the? Yeah, on the, oh shoot, on the side. Okay. This one is curious. This is the one I actually saw and purchased. It's a champagne creamy color and I thought that would look really pretty like wet on the lid. I thought that would be really pretty. That's why I bought that. These I bought, um, 
make like I bought like a mystery bag I bought two of them and um, so these came in my mystery bag I'm gonna try to take them out it's always right when you need to we do that one this <laughs> Okay, I just gotta go okay. this one is called oh, shoot. oh yeah wait that one was curious the champagne one I bought this one is called corrupted and it's just it. really dark it's like a deep I think it's like a slate gray like a really really deep gray I'm pretty I'm honestly like I really like grays I'm really excited for that one I, I also got this one in what was the name of that one this was corrupted oh that's right you told me this one is confident and it's like a bronzy it's a little bit lighter than what it shows kind of. yeah but it's more shimmery it's not a matte this yeah. one's a shimmer that one was this the one matte, matte. Yep. that was the one matte I got um I also got oh as you can see my brows are done right now I got this brow palette and I got it's in here I gotta show these together the brow brush oh yeah oh I look there's more stuff in here just a little with that I think that. Okay, so I got this brow brush. It's an angled on one, a flat to really outline it with concealer on the other. And then I got the darkest shade because I have really dark brows and my friend has really dark brows so we can share it. So, yeah. but I don't know how to do my eyebrows yet. So, we're learning. We're learning makeup. Mm -hmm. It's a process. There's no right or wrong, you know. So, these two are powders. This is the wax to hold it in, which I did use it and you could tell. Yeah. I'm gonna start using like something else to do. I used my finger and I really wish I wouldn't have. This is the highlight and then this is supposed to be like a rose thing you use underneath your highlight and you put the highlight on top and it's supposed to make it really stand out. I did not use that today because I was like, all right, baby steps. Yeah. But I'm really excited that that's just the brow obsession palette and I think I paid, I paid less than 30 for this. Yeah, that, that one, okay. This one I was excited about. I think everybody, yeah. when you think unique, you think this. Yeah, the 3D fiber mascara gel. Which is what, here, let me see if I can show you guys. This is actually what I have on my eyelashes right now. I don't know if you can really tell. Cause I don't really. We well, don't have a comparison either. Yeah, I don't really have long lashes though, so I feel like my friend who wore it and I saw her wear it, it was like, oh my god, she has really long lashes to begin yeah. with. Mine are kind of short and stubby. I think they made the, my bottom lashes look a lot better yeah. than normal though. I really like that. You can take it out if you want to show. I have really short lashes, so the center. Oh, well, here yeah. you. Uh, yeah. Go ahead. There you go. It comes yeah. with. I don't know if you're familiar with, with it. It comes with two things. You get fibers and you get, uh, gel. what is it called? The gel? Yeah. Oh, it's just called the gel? They just, <laughs> they just refer to it as like a gel mascara thing that you, it holds the fibers to your eyelashes. Yeah. So and it seals them back on because you apply it oh. afterwards as well. Yes. You go, it goes gel, fibers, gel. And it's supposed to be like. Which one's which, dude? The, this one's the fibers, the tiny one. It tells okay. you on the back. Well, geez, I obviously don't know how to read. Okay, well, big ones, gel, small ones, fibers. And here, I'm gonna show you guys what this fibers looks like, because when I pulled it out, I was like... Yeah. She hasn't seen it in person yet. She saw it. On a video. Like... Oh, yeah. Let me see if I can... It just looks really cool. It kind of looks like magnets, like mini magnets all stuck It together. does. I don't think you can really... Tell. Tell. It looks like little lashes yeah. and fur. And they just, just stuck. Extend. They just extend. It's re it's really weird. I don't I don't get it, but you know. But it's cool. That's true. That's true. What else we got? Ooh, I got. Here you go, show that one. I got these three things kind of just go. To, I don't know if I drop it. These three things just kind of go together. I got a foundation, which I'll show you. I got the. It's. I technically got the. Um, powdered foundation to wear over it because I need full coverage because I have really bad skin right now so and, and until my skin gets better I choose full coverage that's how I am and then I got the brush which has a little hole in the middle I really don't know the point of that but I applied everything with the brush today so this is what the foundation looks like comes in a little bottle like this I got organza which I literally think is the second color 
of the lettuce. And I probably need the, the first. <laughs> so it's just like, like a dropper. Yeah. You pick up the makeup. Oh, that's so, that's one of those things that's like oddly satisfying to yeah. watch. So Honor. that's the color. And then this is organza as well. And this is the pressed foundation. It's actually a powder foundation, but I would never just use that. It would not look good. So it just comes like this. Pull that off. Pull the plastic thing off. And then it's just like that. And I like that it has this to keep this all covered and yeah. away. And I won't use this. I'm sorry, I just won't. I have my Real Technique powder brush for that. And then second yeah, to last. I don't like those pads. Yeah, it it's, it's like, it on. yes, too cakey. Like, I like full coverage, but I don't like to look like I'm yeah. dressed in frosting. I show the box, but the palette actually has the same thing. Yeah, it does. <laughs> so this is the Moostruck Addiction, and it's an eyeshadow palette. Yeah, it's the number one. How pretty is that? So I'll do like a, like a woo. It's so pretty. I'm wearing, let's see. I'm wearing this one, which is chipped in my crease. And then I'm wearing swanky, swanky. on my lid. I thought that said shanky. And I'm like, what? <laughs> swanky on my lid. I love, here, I'll swatch one on my finger. For you guys, do you want we'll me to do. hold it? Yeah, which one should we do? Brassy. Do it. Yeah, do a metallic -y one. People really like that. There's brassy. I don't know if you can really tell in this lighting. It's really, really. Ooh. I don't know if you can really tell by my tattoo. It's right there. It's really pretty. It's yeah. very shimmery. A shimmery color is very shimmery. <laughs> I really like that one. Here, I'll swatch her darkest so, of dark. I think it's like a, a deep like bronze. One. On this end, one. Yeah, the zealous is what's called. Ooh, Ooh. Yeah, I really like. I like dark. Let me put it right next to it. I like really dark pigmented you do. eyeshadows, even though it doesn't match my skin. That's really pretty. I've been told I'm a winter and I should not wear dark colors, but you know what? I wear dark colors all the time. I'm not wearing any unique makeup, but uh, it's like a burgundy I got on. I like I like deep colors. It's my thing. I don't know why. I have one last thing here. This is a surprise. This was the extra product in the what like the grab bag thing, yeah, the bobber. Like little party bag things. So. They were like, here, it's a mystery bag. Get what you want. This is the eye pencil. Oh yeah. It's in pre precarious. It's a deep dark blueish. Yeah. But really pretty. It is so very uh, vibrant. Actually. I know it's way vibrant than what I. Really I am haven't used a pencil liner in a really or like a what would you call that? Like a not necessarily a pencil, but you know, like a something that isn't liquid. I yeah yeah. I've been using a lot of I liquid, and I haven't putting anything on my waterline. I used to put it on my waterline all the time. I don't do it anymore. I don't. I don't really know why I don't do it anymore. I don't like it. It. It just irritates my eyes. I mean, I'm not yeah, saying that it doesn't it look good. I, if I put it there, it just makes my eyes really itchy, or my eyelashes down there kind of get a little. It can't, or or I just maybe it's also because we've just been using drugstore. So every time I do it, it runs down my eye, and then it just looks like I now have a black. Well, usually I like a nice sharp wing, and mm -hmm. I'm good to go. I didn't do that. I'm not very sense. good at sharp wings yet. I'm learning though. I'm learning. I'm getting a little more comfortable with the liquid and then eventually hopefully more comfortable at all. And ooh, I got this bag too. I got another one, which I gave her and a couple products that were in it. The lip, oh, the lip that you're wearing now is the Bon Bon and it's like, I think it's red velvet cake. I don't know. But I think it's red velvet cake. And then I got this cute little bag. She gave it to me. She's like, here, now you get a bag because you did the goodie bag. I wonder if it's actually from Unique. I don't think, it doesn't look like that's the brand. No, I don't think I think is. she just got them. Like and she was like, here, now I'm going to do these uh, free makeup stuff. Because right. what you do is you pay like 25 bucks, and then you get 35 bucks worth of product. Like $10 more, so it's pretty cool. Yeah. Well, that's kind of it that we have for my haul. I just kind of wanted to show you. I'm wearing, I'm really liking it so far. Everything went on really well. The brows, I think I did pretty decent at for literally this is my first time ever doing my brows officially. Yeah, I still need to start. 
hey, yeah, yeah, this is the first time. Well, I need to get him like waxed, yeah. yep. so then I can yep. actually shape. I got mine waxed at. I think I told them. I think um, Ulta. At Ulta. Yeah, I got a brow bar. The brow bar is amazing. Brow bar. And then the stuff that they used was really good. I just wanted to try the unique stuff because I guess this was new. This brow palette was like brand new. So I was like, hey, whatever, I'll try it. Yeah. Um, I like it so far. I'm liking everything so far except I'm not loving the liquid lipstick. But I'll keep using it and trying it and trying to finesse it because I don't know if I'm using it right per se. But we're going to go now. We got kids just freaking out out there. So we got to get out there. But... Thank you very much for watching, even though this wasn't a vlog. And we will see you later, alligator. Hey, what's up, guys? What's up, guys? Just doing some makeup. <laughs> How you doing? I was born this way. Something, 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 something. No, I need to set my butt. Yeah, see, I don't know how you were going to do that for the whole time. I wasn't. I was <laughs> Guess what's behind you? A door that nothing could come out of except for aliens. Dude, I fucking. You need a tripod next time you invite me to this shit. Wait, this. Hey, how are you? Okay, that was a minute. Dude, did it get dark? Yeah, I'm gonna try to turn this light on. That didn't.